I made a mistake and came to Costco on a Sunday. I came here last week, but I came right when they opened. Um, it's noon now, almost noon, and I am going to again show you guys hopefully a shop with me and then a haul, the things that I bought. It's only been a week since I've been here, so I'm not sure how many new things that they have, but we're gonna go check them out. Okay, so the first thing I see are these towels. They're $18 for six of them. Like, oh my gosh, they're so heavy, right there. And then right next to it is just a single towel for 10, which the quality of this one is obviously much nicer. And I assume maybe it's bigger, I don't know. I mentioned last week the price of their pillows is insane. This is an organic pillow, two for 10. What? Oh my word, if you are thinking about Christmas gifts already, these are adorable. I can't get enough of them. They're $14 for one. And then these sleeping bags are enormous. We got two for the kids' birthdays like a few years ago. They're $27. Totally worth it. The kids pull them out almost every time we have a movie night. A mermaid? Shut up. Moving down the line, I see some curtains. Come on, guys. $16 for two panels and looks like they have four colors which isn't bad they're thermal room darkening that is a steal okay on the topic of Christmas just while we're here because I'm already excited about it first of all there's Halloween costumes over there Costco has them what are your kids going to be for Halloween let me know but for now wrapping paper look how much they have and it's double-sided for $13 I can't explain to you how much wrapping paper you get in these things. I had one, it lasted me, I, I'm pretty sure I still have it, it's been like three years. <laughs> oh, here's a better shot of the prints that they have. Like, what? I see these hangers out again, they're always a great deal. They're $13 for 50, what? All right, here is this shelf. I have one under my sink that's similar. It was $15 at the store. Now it's on sale for 11. I mean, Amazon sells these things for like upwards of $30, you know, so that is a definite steal if you're in the market for one. Over here, a new, ooh, a storage organizer. I don't know about the quality of these guys. Let's feel. Oh my gosh, they're pretty sturdy, which is nice. Underneath though is um, the same kind of fabric. Seems nice. How much is that? Yoey, $50. What? Blow dryers, hold on, this one's 20 for a blow dryer and this is 100. I don't know. Oh, this this is um, 60 though, I feel like that's a good deal. I don't know, I know nothing about hair. Hold the phone, this thing's only $30. First of all, he's cutting his own hair. What a man. <laughs> and all the accessories you get in there, what? At Target, this would be like, I don't know, double the price. Is it sad that I'm already thinking of Christmas presents, but this comes with one one whole toothbrush and then two extra heads and some toothpaste. 30 bucks, which seems a little... It comes with a two-minute timer, so is that worth the $30? Oh my word, guys. Pajama sets. Look at this one. This dog. This little monster. Oh, he's a karate guy. Holy crap. $8. What? Okay, stop it. Before we get to the toys over there, I thought I would come in here and not have anything to show you. These boots. $24? Are you kidding me? What? I'm not even a boot girl, but that gets even me excited. And of course they have other shoes, but meh. I told you guys I'm in the market for a pillow and some of you said this one was really nice. I wonder how many people have rest their head on this pillow. <laughs> this lamp is so pretty, but I think I saw in Audrey's haul that they had a table lamp. I guess I missed out on that one. I don't see it. I've been hearing a lot about these. Apparently a lot of people have them. Dashboard cameras? I don't know. Do you have one? I just, I don't know if it's necessary for my life, but it's $190. I definitely smell the holidays in this store. They have pumpkin streusel muffins. What? Two for $8, two packs, amazing. Oh my gosh, stop it. Someone take me away. I don't know if I can walk away from these guys. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I was able to, we're safe. But now I see the pumpkin pie. Six dollars. Guys, this thing is huge. Here's my hand. 
enormous. Is this a joke? This cake is $16.99. Oh my. I don't know, guys. I. Mm -mm. It reminds me of Matilda. Like, I would eat that entire confection. I can't. Let's go. Tell me I'm not the only one who saw this and read Tailgate. <laughs> I was like, Tailgate? I don't know if that's a tailgate food. <laughs> but it's new and it's 10 bucks. Okay, I'm sorry. Do they always sell this? I feel like I don't always see it. $7 for that huge tub? Someone give me a spoon. A Vitamix for $350. I smell a Christmas gift. They also still have the Instapot. Oh no, I'm running over a garbage can. We made it. Guess what they don't have at my Costco anymore. Oh, hippies. Nope, don't have them anymore. They used to be here. Ugh, disgusted. Disgusted by your organic cheddar cheesy smiles. <laughs> Okay, we are back at home. Um, I also, after Costco, went to Aldi because there's an Aldi right next to our Costco that I've never been to. And I actually ended up leaving with nothing. I, I don't know why. And then I ended up going to Publix because I knew I needed a couple more things to round out the week's food supply. So I got a few things from Publix. But when I went inside, there was a coupon at Publix. It was like, spend $50 and get $10 off a gas card, which is always a deal. So I ended up spending like $56 or something. Anyway, I'll get to that when we get there. But first I'll show you everything I got at Costco. Okay, so here's the haul as a whole. Costco and then Publix over there. So we got some sprouts, some of my fave, raspberries, bananas, a bunch of lettuce, my fave, um, and then bell peppers, which we sometimes get, sometimes don't. But it's always a good price at Costco. I also got veggie straws. I feel like I haven't gotten these in a really long time. We've been on like a boom chicka pop kick and uh, what else have we been buying? I don't know, other snacks. But I finally got those and I cracked them open because Wentworth asked for some and oh, so good. So salty, but so good. Um, I also got a couple of things of strawberries. These were a great price, under $4 for each one. And then a bunch of croissants. You guys saw, I resisted the cake and the chocolatey cookies, so I treated myself with that. I don't, everyone loves croissants, okay? I also got a, three cucumbers. Well, these come as one, cucumbers. And then, I can't live my life anymore without this stuff. So, of course, I got some Jack's Salsa. It is the best, it's so good. And then, this is the first time I've gotten these, um, layered fruit bars. They had these as samples, and I swear, that's how they get you at Costco. Here, try this, it's great. And then you try it and you're like, this is great. And so you end up buying it. So they have two flavors, strawberry banana, which I did not try, and then pineapple passion fruit, delicious. There's 12 of each. Um, and these were like, uh, I wanna say, actually I don't remember. Hopefully I can put the price here, but I w they were around $10, $10 or less kind of thing. Uh, here's a peek at the nutrition labels if you are interested in that. Ooh, and there's Veronica's story on the side. Ooh, at age six, my daughter decided to become a vegetarian. Hey, oh, good for you, Veronica. You are a better woman than I am. All right, I also got some knives. Last year I saw them, I feel like, uh, I always see these, I, why the, whether, oh my gosh, I can't speak because I'm so excited, whether they're at Sam's Club or Costco. I bought these from Sam's Club years and years ago. Here, they're all in here, but they were like colored and they have different colors on them. Here's the, the bread knife right here. I use them all the time and they're like four, I want to say maybe even five years old. I treated myself to them and back then I thought that was a big purchase. It was a treat, but now I'm like, $13, they were $12.99 for a whole set of knives. I couldn't resist and since those are so old, it's just easier to buy a new set than to get them sharpened and stuff, you know? So anyway, and they're all black, which I kind of like that. And then I got some tortilla chips to go with Jack Salsa. Oh my gosh, the other day I got a comment. And I, whenever I say tortilla, I always get comments, but someone said, you really need to learn how to say tortilla. <laughs> I was like, I know how to say it. It's just funny to say tortilla. Am I wrong? I don't know. It reminds me of like Napoleon Dynamite, even though I'm not even sure where that's from. Okay, and then I got a bunch of meat. I need to take a, a lesson from Victoria here and not buy this, but I don't, I, I needed ham. And then it also came with turkey, so I thought, why not? This was like 10 bucks. And then 
Um, everything else is from Publix. I got some pizza dough, obviously, to make pizza. We have cheese in our fridge slash freezer that has been there for uh, a while, so I need to get rid of it. And every day, I'm like, oh, I need to make pizza dough from scratch because it's so easy, but I just keep forgetting, so I figured I'd buy some. I also got three things of chickpeas. I like to make my Italian chopped salsa, salsa, <laughs> salad. With that Italian chopped salad, that recipe's on my channel. And then I also throw these in, the artichokes. I got some apples, a um, couple onions, some oh, olives, which I meant to get Katamala olives for my salad, but whatever, I'll deal with those. And then I got raisins, that's a great snack. These are the un-sour kind, just normal, everyday raisins. I'm trying to kick things back, kick things back to the old days where I kept everything simple, homemade, that kind of thing, even though I <laughs> homemade pizza dough. Anyway, okay, I got some bread. This was buy one, get one free. It's just 12 grain, nothing special. These were buy one, get one, and the kids love them, so I figured I would show them how much I love them by getting them a treat. <laughs> and then I also got some O's. They love those as well. And I got a bunch of pasta, four things of pasta, two penne and two seashells. It's just quick, easy dinner. Um, I also got some bagels. Oh, I'm not even showing you. Eleanor likes these. There's four in there. And milk. Alex goes through milk like it's going out of style. Like so much milk. I don't drink milk, but apparently everyone else in my house does because we go through so much of it. Uh, what else do I have? Summer sausage for the chopped Italian salad. Some salami, which now I guess I forgot that I got this at Costco because I also got salami, which whatever, we'll go through it. And that's it. Okay, that is everything that I got in my Sam slash Publix haul. Um, looking at it, it doesn't look like that much, but it will definitely last us a week, if not more, some of these things. So, thank you guys for hanging out with me, and I hope you enjoyed the shop with me. Let me know if you like the combined videos. Some of you like that. I would rather do them separately, just because I like to focus on one thing at a time, but if you guys like them combined, like last week, uh, that's why I did it again this week, and whatever. Anyway, thanks for hanging out, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Wait, I can't. Dad, what are you doing? <laughs> what? Are you... Is this some kind of punishment? <laughs> yeah. Daddy, he, uh, yeah, it's a punishment. He said he wants to get hit. I didn't say that when we came, so this is a punishment for coming. <laughs> You're being so silly. Oh. <laughs> Dad! <laughs> I don't like that. I do. I Pizza like dough. It's one way to knead the dough. Hey.